game, though, to make it straight to winner's finals. Yeah. So I know that he's picked up that Falco. Yeah, he's had the Falco for a while. I think that, uh, you know, I mean, he was a, a pit main in Brawl, and obviously his pit is very solid in this game. But I think his heart is truly with Falco. Falco At the end of the Lucina. day, yeah, Falco and Lucina. Um, but I think the thing is, is that it, it's tough, I think, for, for him to go with Falco a lot of the time. It is. I and mean, I think that up against Luigi, I think I'd be also very tough, so... Yeah, Luigi has those fares to zone pretty much anything out. And yeah. Falco having those fast but small hitboxes, you're not going to have a good time. Yeah. So... Now, I know that we... I'm not sure if we saw this matchup last night, um, but Ashura definitely made it to, I think it was, uh, winner's finals, loser's finals last night, uh, all that. So loser's finals, I believe. I took third place there. It's doing some good stuff. Or fourth. Third, fourth. Third. Uh, third or, yeah, third. Third. One of those. Yeah. In my defense, I went straight from there to springs to back here. So yeah, I understand. No sleep. I understand. But In my defense, I only somewhat watched all of the whole thing sometimes, some kind of thing. Yeah. Not really all the whole thing. And check the score, see who's, see who's doing well. It looks all like right. we've got the dark pit, or no, vanilla pit. It's the regular off. pit disguised as dark pit. Ah, he's going for those yes. mind games yeah, exactly. right off the bat. Except... <laughs> Some mind game. Joe's going to yeah. see the dark guy. Think it's All another right. brother. He ain't going to hit him. And now we're talking stages. They're thinking about going straight to Smashville. Respectable decision in this matchup, I think. A good vanilla stage. We got the Ouija versus Pit, so neither of them are going to really suffer from that moving platform. No, no, not at all. And there's plenty of room to run around. I said there is a lot of deliberation going on. I thought we had a big battlefield there for a second. No. The match would take all day. No way. A lot of deliberation going on about this stage choice. I'm really not sure what's going on. And it's going to be Town City or Smashville? Oh, one of the two. We will find out soon. Smashville. And we're going to Smashville. All right, so Game here on. we go. Gay versus Ashura. Winner's finals. Yeah, so Gay's obviously, he talked about it earlier about bringing out the Luigi as opposed to the Sonic where you know, he felt like he finally figured out how to recover. So <laughs> he's played Luigi in every iteration of the game. And yeah, I know that now that he has the Luigi, you know, we'll see what uh, he can do with this up in Winter's Finals. I know he's been clinging on to it as a good secondary, but I, he said today he really wanted to try to develop it in bracket. It looks like he's sticking with it for at least this first game. Well, it's, good, it's good to see. It's good to see some variety for sure. It's, it's quite solid. He's got those reads, he can get those up smashes, and he's very good yeah. at being patient and zoning with those fairs. Yeah, well, I think that's just a sign of him being just a good player overall. I mean, he has very, very good fundamentals, and I think that helps him out a lot, not only in this game, but also just playing multiple characters in this game. Definitely. He can pick up yeah. a pocket character in just a couple nights of practice. However, Ezra not is not somebody yeah. to sleep on. And though the percentages are a bit different, sure is not too bad off go. by any means. Yeah, this is a little bit rough for Pit, though. Luigi's grab game, of course, one of the best in the game. He needs to try to keep him out of range, hopefully get some type of gimp stuff off stage with those arrows. And he goes for the hard read, gets punished for it with a dash attack, yeah. but there's no follow-up. I actually think in terms of the way that this match should play out, in terms of play styles, I think it actually should, in theory, favor Ashura just ever so slightly, just because I feel like Gaze is the kind of person who, he plays at two ranges, up in your face and from full screen. He, he doesn't, doesn't play does. the mid-range game very much, and I think that Ashura plays the mid-range game very well. Now that said, Ashura is going to want to try and keep Luigi away so he doesn't get grabbed and doesn't have to deal with Luigi's jab game. Yep. But he takes that first yeah. stock and a nice lead. And I think that because of that, what you're going to see is you're going to see Eshera get a lot of grabs, get a lot of good reads on rolls. But uh, look for, for Gay to uh, sneak his way in. Maybe he can take the stock. Once he gets those combos started, yeah. he's not done for a Ooh. while. Ooh. Good to to get out of that, that cyclone. That would have killed. Killed at that percentage, and they both reset to the neutral. Gay looking for that kill fishing a little bit. Yeah. As he goes for a release and maybe an up smash here. Nope. Yeah, he's looking a little bit desperate now, and he needs to be uh, careful to avoid that so he doesn't eat too much punishment. Yep. He go. definitely has a Sambo, okay, solid close game. Okay. So as long as he just keeps his head and stays in there, 47% isn't too big of a lead. Yeah, you see, he's charging these up smashes. He's trying to get these kill really, really bad. But I just don't think he's going to get it like that. Uh, yeah, 150%. 157 Ooh. Uh, dies to that up smash. Yeah. That's a 56% stock game. Pretty good lead, and he's going to get more out of that here. 70, 80. Nice combo, up to 78. 
a little strange. Like, he wanted to follow the DI, realized he couldn't, and then backed away to make himself safe. Smart move to avoid that fireball. Yeah. Could have led me something nice, but he's got his own combo going now. Yeah. And Gay's just trying to recover safely. And... Mm. Yeah, he tried to read the uh, spot dodge or the roll right there. They tried to read the roll towards the stage, but... Joe isn't out of this yet. And he gets some Ooh. nice string going. Another there we go. Yeah. Both, they're both using Nairs to try to keep each other out now. Yeah, unfortunately, he, unfortunately, Escher is kind of forced to use that Nair in that situation. He is. If he goes for the spot dodge, his landing gets punished. If he goes for pretty much anything at that point, he gets punished. So, And he's got a pretty good range with that Nair, yeah. so he can just keep him away for as long as he wants. Yeah. Sorry, guys. There's a chopper outside. If you hear some background noise. You guys might want to get to it. Okay, he throws him back, and now we've got Eshra in a bad Ooh, position. Oh, he, he knew he was going to side B, but he didn't connect with the down air. He's got Gets the trumped. reach, but he messed up the timing. Yeah, now this is a really precarious situation. Limited recovery options, but he sneaks his way back onto the ledge. And they're both fishing for a grab, looking to combo yeah. into some type of smash or maybe fair. And Joe gets oh, it. Grab release. At 84%, out. it's not quite death percent yeah. for Pit, but definitely for Luigi. He gets that back throw to Arrow, but it misses. Ooh, sniped him. Oh, and that'll be it. Yeah. Yeah. Close it out. Yeah, he matched that just a little bit too hard. Ended up landing right next to Escher on stage. Yep. I don't think he was trying to go for that cheap kill. I think he was just trying to get back around in yeah, that little I lip of the ledge right there. So I think he was trying to sweet spot it and just missed it. Yeah. Unfortunate, but uh, Escher is going to take game one there. Definitely. We'll not see what Gay has to go with. Is not, he going to stick with his character? Not too commanding a victory, though. It was, it was nice and close. And he's going right back into it. Very good, though. All right. Town and city. Let's see what he can figure out here. And Ashura's on the tag from the get-go. Looks like his win gave him a bit of confidence. And now he's got Joe's back to the ledge. Yeah, I think what we're seeing here is that Ashura has been consistently winning out in these neutral situations. But when Gate does get something started, it's very hard for Ashura to really recover from it. It is. He has to really fall back very heavily on his defense. Yeah, he needs to maintain that stage position so he's Ooh. not caught in a risky place. But Joe <laughs> gets that nice side beat and, and that's, up smash yeah. to punish. Good punish there for Gay. Okay. Very good and is turning this right around, almost bringing the percentages even, but Ashura wants to stretch out that lead a bit more as he goes for that grab. Ooh, good spot dodge. Very good. Both yeah. of them just trading jab combos and smashes, looking for some off-stage action. Back throw. Sure we get a scene go off-stage again? Yes, we do, and good very tech there. That was actually a pretty tough tech to get, so I'm very impressed. That is, multiple hits of the tornado. Yeah, multi-hits of a tornado, and you probably hit the wall multiple times, but the super, super armor. armor. Very good yeah. coming through for him, preventing him from dying. Yeah, Ashura mixes up his recovery very, very well. He's a very tricky player to really read off-stage. He is. And In he general, he just has a very good offstage game, both offensively and defensively. So, Usually can get back on, and yeah. he also mixes it up when you're trying to combo him. He may air dodge sometimes, sometimes not. Oh, a forward throw will do it. Very good, 123%. Yeah. Let's see if he can tack on any extra credit. Yeah, Gay did not look very happy with that one. wonder what he uh, was trying to go for there that ended up getting him grabbed. Good jab combo. I hope he doesn't get too desperate here. Sure is playing it safe, just rolling back, yep. zoning with a couple of Ooh. caught by that All right. up smash. Roll behind up smash, the classic. Shoutouts to Mario, shoutouts to Luigi. He uses that invincibility Ooh. to get dash tech off. Now he's got a nice combo going. But Luigi answers <laughs> And the uh, unfortunate there for Eshera, the side B, yeah, the side B was popped by the fireball. Left him in a very precarious position. He may have fallen off the stage if he didn't do the second one. Here we go. Here we are. Winners finals. Dead even. Game two. 46 to 47. Now 62. Uh, Both fishing right. around playing a great neutral game. No two oh, good mistakes. Oh, no. Guy. I'm sure a side beast to his death. Unfortunate that uh, he didn't get that. To end like that. Yeah. But it's 1 1 now. It is a best out of five, so we'll be seeing at least two more games. Yep. And who do you think is looking? in the position to clutch it out. Um, I think based off of what we've seen in these two games, I would probably favor Eshira right now. Okay. I don't think Gay has made sufficient adjustment yet. Very good. Um, I think that he's 
been approaching and he's been caught in the air a few too many times. Now when he has gotten something started, it's been very good. Yeah. And I think a lot of that has to do with the Pit Luigi matchup mm -hmm. up close. Um, so I, was, I think this is this should be an interesting an interesting set to yeah. say the least. But they go to Battlefield, the three platform stage lending itself to a lot of combo potential here, so we'll see if yeah. he can take advantage of that. Yeah, Eshira's Eshira also though, I mean this is his counter pick. He benefits a lot from this stage just by virtue of the fact that his character does have that up smash, does have up air, and does have Nair. All yeah. really great tools for catching people on platforms, keeping people on platforms. Definitely. If he can keep uh, Gay in the air yeah. for a long time, get those combos yeah. off. Now that said with Luigi, I feel like Luigi has a lot of really good tricks to get himself off of platforms, come down and be generally pretty safe or be able to actually counterattack very effectively. Yeah, with his Nair, it's a great option if somebody's in your face and the fireball can zone them out. Pick a Nair dodge or two and you're on your way back to the ground. Here we go, back throw. Oh, nice air dodge too. And he gets a side beat. Can he get the kill from this? Nope, sure nice. fades back just enough, landing that side beat. Escher has been going for a lot of forward airs off the stage, but Gay has really called out the timings just so precisely. Yeah, he's, he's been able to hit him with his up he been able to hit him with some move that will break up the start up of forward air. Really good stuff there. Air dodging so he doesn't get caught by too many shenanigans. Luigi has a good recovery in this game, but you don't want to yeah. test it. Yeah, it's a tricky recovery, for sure. And uh, I like the jab grab there. mix up. Very good. It yeah, actually he, outranges that in there. Yeah. What I like about that jab grab, though, I mean, Eshera had been going for jab jab or jab jab jab, but then just to go for the jab grab just to mix things up in yeah. a very simple but effective way is really nice. Keep him on his toes. Yep. He's got that four throw. Shield grab to Not fourth throw. And he still has his jump, so this is a living Luigi. But will he die to a back throw here? No. No snipe. He's definitely in four throw range, so he needs to be careful. And gets popped up yeah. by the down air. Forced to use. No. Oh wow. No response there from Eshera. 173% is, is yeah. staying in this, avoiding the And that should hits. that should do it. And forward threat to death. Good DI, but the drift kills him. Yeah. I mean that stock lasted a very long time and didn't quite capitalize on the time he had. It did. But even if he lost the stock, he knows now that if he plays his game right, he can survive to well, pretty high is, percentages. Yeah, this is the tricky part, though. I mean, Ashura has a nice bit of rage. He's going to attack on a lot of extra credit percent with just a few hits. 54% already. He zoned out those fireballs, not blocking that arrow, yeah. but the down B saving him again. I kind of feel like we should know the names of some of these moves. Uh, I mean, I Luigi just call Tornado? Luigi Tornado, Cyclone, I don't know. Well, he's got Ashura's back to the edge. Ashura's attacked on 91 damage. That was another really good nice. jab mix up there from Ashura. I like how he's mixing those up effectively. Goes for the ledge trump, forcing him back on stage. All right, down throw. Yeah, now Gay's looking a little bit desperate for this kill right now. He's fishing for it, and looks yeah. like it's going to cost him with that back air to arrow. Do you think after this game he'll stick with Luigi, or do you think he'll go back to the Sonic? Um, I think he'll go back to Sonic. Yeah, he doesn't look too disappointed in his Luigi's performance. Yeah, I think his Luigi. I mean, his Luigi has gotten him to winners finals. Yeah. Right, and now he's up against one of the favorites to take the tournament. Definitely. So I think that for sure, like, he has a lot to be proud of for this Luigi today. He so, does. And he can that said, though, I mean. This is winner's side, so maybe if he wants to test out the Luigi for another game, he has the opportunity to do so. But if I know Gay, I mean, I think he'll want that grand final slot. Super armor through the fireball, yeah. takes the stock. And that's a meaty side B. Hmm. Yep, 2-1 to Ashura. Putting Joe on his winner's bracket life. All right. Gay looks like he really wants to get back into it right away. He does. He he likes to get in the zone, stay in the zone. What I like to see, what I like though from Escher is that I like that in in the past few times we've seen him where his performances haven't been necessarily that great. He's looked a little bit distressed, a little bit shaky, very sweaty, sort of just uncomfortable is what I would say. But if you look at him right now through the looking glass of that beautiful bottle, yeah. uh, he just looks he looks calm. He looks collected. He looks normal. Calm and composed, and that's definitely when he plays his best. Yeah. So here we go. And he does not switch. Yeah, I mean, you know what? Sticking to his guns. He says he, keeps, he believes in this Luigi. Perhaps he just wants more data. Who knows? Doesn't matter. We're at FD, and we are at Luigi and Pit. I can't beat his Luigi, so I'm going to trust his judgment. Yeah. And his, his doing pretty I mean, look, most of the people here couldn't beat his Luigi. Yeah. That's, like, today, his Luigi has been putting in work. 
So uh, he's definitely not out of this yet, especially if he keeps this really good grab game going that I've seen from him so far. He's taking the lead in percentage here. Not too bad, getting a bunch of nice reads. His yeah. movement is fluid and is just chasing Ashura everywhere. He can't get any room. Yeah. Well, one tricky thing, I think, for, for Gay that I think it would really make a little bit of a difference in this matchup is if he had a better read on Ashura's landing. Because Eshera likes to mix it up with these jumps, these tricky sort of jumps where he'll he'll sort of like look like he's gonna land and then just do a nice little another jump. He has that opportunity because he's pit. But we're seeing oh no the misfire putting him in a very precarious spot. Down B questionable call, but it does save him, and he's still ahead in percentage. Does not hit that back here for the kill, but he is still in this 82%. It looks like Eshera is trying to take that lead. Yeah, just to finish what I was saying before, I definitely think that Gay could get uh, some better follow-ups or perhaps even better punishes if he had a better read on Eshera's uh, landing, especially after the down throw. So right here. Yeah, Eshera is Okay, like right there. Like, he, he saw what Eshera was going for, but the spacing wasn't quite what he needed to yeah. take it. Getting a read on your opponent's DI. Yeah, and nice back air. No tech, though, from Eshera. That looked like it was very close to the wall. The closer you are to the wall, it's much, much harder to tech. Yep, and this man, Gay, actually told me just today that if you're directly against the wall, you cannot tech. That is true. Um, if you're too close, you don't actually have, like, the frame. It just turns out, like, the, the frames don't work out in your favor at all whatsoever. Yeah, you don't have the frame for the info. Yeah. Uh, Sure, it keeps on going for those ledge trumps. Definitely not leaving Joe for any uh, forward throw. Yeah. Now that said, though, uh, it is t entirely possible if you know you're going to get hit with a move, um, and you're worried about being too close to the wall, you can actually SD like start spamming SDI to move yourself into a position where you're further away from the wall. Okay. Normally, that sounds insane. It's like, why am I DIing into the move that's hitting me into the away? You know, yeah. it sounds wrong, right? You'd think you'd want to DI into the into the wall, but. Uh, if you SDI away, you can actually get far enough away with just a few uh, ticks that um, yeah, ticks of hit lag, and you'll actually be able to, or hit stun, sorry. You'll actually be able to tech. Well, it looks like Joe's choice to stay Luigi is paying off for him as it's 45 to 107 percent. Well, that's going to get punished. And can sure keep this combo going? And that this is all, like Gay got, or sorry, Escher has gotten so much just because Gay went for a side B out of nowhere. Yeah, definitely, definitely hitting that on shield is not something you yeah. want to do. This is huge right here. And, and he lets Eshera back on and gets a grab. But yeah, this is... Smartly oh, again. the up smash. Hard Not quite going to do it. Roll. FD is pretty big. Here we go. Is going to get another up smash to close it out. But no, he gets grabbed. And just released, hoping for maybe... Uh -oh. Yeah, try to get the ledge from there. Doesn't get it in the back here. All right, now this is a really important recovery. Will Eshera close it out right here? Oh, that back here might have done it. Very good, though, keeping just out of range with that down B, too. Yeah, that's that, dodge. that's that classic every Smash game, just fading away. Yep. From from danger. And hopefully you don't fade away too much. Yeah. But they're both fishing for that grab now. Joe's looking for an up smash as well, yeah. maybe? Yeah, I think, honestly, just looking at the way they're playing, I've seen a lot of rolls from Gay, a lot of hesitation, a lot of... And spike. Beautiful spike. And... Gay is yeah. not mad about that one. He's yeah, I laughing it off. Yeah, I think the uh, the reality of that situation, if you just look at it, I, I, I kind of feel like Gay during that last stock, at that, that sort of clutch moment, he looked very nervous. He was doing a lot of rolls, a lot of spot dodges.